Greetings and happy first birthday to our friends and colleagues at the Nelson Mandela Children's Hospital in Johannesburg, South Africa. In May of 1995, as he launched the Children's Fund that would bear his name, President Nelson Mandela said, there can be no keener revelation of a society's soul than the way in which it treats its children. On this milestone anniversary for the Nelson Mandela Children's Hospital, you all have clearly put his words into practice. Through the inspiring work of your team of doctors, nurses, and other health professionals at a wonderful, hopeful facility that acquires new expertise and capacity every day. It's been an honor for us at Project Hope to have contributed to the early planning and we congratulate the hospital and its partners on the construction and systematic commissioning of your beautiful and hopeful facility. Believing in President Mandela's vision and in the interest of children's health worldwide, we look forward to doing our part to partner further to build your capacity. The hospital has a special resonance for us at Project Hope because its mission accords with our mission and the goals of other children's hospitals we've been pri privileged to support in China, in Eastern Europe, and the Middle East the establishment of a high-quality pediatric workforce that offers the promise of generations of care that our children deserve. Your hospital will be a beacon for pediatric excellence, not just in South Africa, but all over the southern part of this wonderful continent. The hospital also resonates with me personally. In addition to being the CEO of Project Hope, I also happen to be a pediatrician and public health physician, and I had the privilege of working for 15 years for Project Hope and later the US CDC in neighboring Swaziland, Botswana, and Namibia. We lost many children in need of specialized care for congenital heart disease, childhood malignancies, and other serious illnesses. So your hospital now brings hope to many, to society, to families, and of course, the children who simply deserve the right to be children. A project of this size is never easy and won't be easy going forward, but it's for children and therefore is worth every effort. In that 1995 speech, Madiba also said, our actions and policies and the institutions we create should be eloquent with care, respect, and love. That is an apt description of what is now going on at Nelson Mandela Children's Hospital every single day. I wish you all the very best. Thank you, and I hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.